Ooh, text message. Right. So we've got the first clue. Hold on. So the first, first three clue, the the th th three clues. Number one, clue one: someone who helps and supports someone else. Number two, coniferous trees, plural. Number three, four of these make up a square. Okay. Hi all, so I've just been given my um, three word clue um, for our treasure hunt. Um, mine was, clue one was um, someone who helps and supports someone else. Clue two was a con coniferous trees in plural, it has to be plural. Uh, and clue three, Camera can hear you slurping. Sorry. <laughs> clue three. Um, clue three was um, four. Four of these make up a square. So um, the plan is we've got to download uh, the what three apps, what three word app. Um, Supposedly, every three meter square in the world, in the world, has been al allocated a unique combination of three words. Um, so it's supposedly much more accurate than Google Maps or Waze or Tom Tom or the Army or the police or anything ever. So. That's the plan. So I need to work out what these three clues are to give me the three words for the location that I've got to find. And it's within five miles of my home where I, I'm actually in Northampton. So uh, watch this space. Go! Um, so clue one uh, says someone who helps and supports someone else. So um, Cameron came up with friend. friend. Um, I think John said family. Someone else said carer or assistant. Um, and I've just I've I've contacted the headquarters HQ because we were stuck. Kid, we were stucked, and uh, they said it was with. Uh, you have to think of. It with regards to war. So um, let's go see what, um, maybe Kenzie will come up with some, Kenzie's quite quite clever as well. So let's have a look. Kenzie? Yeah? Kenzie. So, um, someone who helps and supports someone else, and it's with regards to war. An ally. 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 Okay. A lie. A lie. A lie. Okay, so we have confirmation from the the gods from a bobs. The gods gods from a bobs. <laughs> <laughs> um ally is the first answer. So number two, uh clue two was um coniferous tree, but it has to be in plural. Coniferous trees um so we came up with firs spruces um a coniferous tree is like a needle needle like thing me bobsy is a thing needle like tree or shrub or something like that um so firs spruces pines cedars all that kind of thing um and number three is um, four of these make up a square. Um, so it could be cor a corners, corner, corners, or sides, or 
What else can make up a square? Cameron? A nerd. <laughs> a nerd. <laughs> that was kind of like a, let's think out of a box. Let's think out of a square. Um, so watch this space. Um, I'm going to try and input these into the, um, three, the what three words app and see if it comes up with a location here in Northampton. Right. Left. Left. Right. So um, we've figured it out. It took us quite a few hours, but it figured it out. So the three word, um, the three words for the what's three words app was clue one was ally, ally, which Kenzie got. Well done, Kenzie. Ally. He's a genius. Ally. And then number two is uh, pines, pines, plural, pine, pines. And number three was sides. So I put that in the app. Put that in the app. And the location is Delapree Abbey. Let's go! Hey, Cameron. Cameron. Hello. Hello. Um, so you've hung out at uh, Delapree Abbey a few times, haven't you? Yeah? Do you know anything about it? What do you know about Delapree Abbey? Court of the War of the Roses was fought in Delapree Abbey, actually. Have you not? Part of the War of the Roses. I think so. I might be wrong. I might be just... Telling everyone like I could be lying to you. <laughs> Don't trust anyone off the internet. <laughs> I could be li I could be lying. Everything could be a lie, and you won't know because I told you. Well, there you go. Let's go find Delapree Abbey and find out if that's the truth. So y'all, so um, I'm at Delapree Abbey. It's all closed up and everything. I've taken a picture. But I just thought I'd tell you a little bit about it. Um, Delapri Abbey um, has expansing slope grounds. Well, it, it's an abbey. The mansion and outbuildings incorporate remains of the former monastery um, near the River Nen, southeast of Northampton. It was found as a nunnery about uh, the year 1145, devoted to the congregation of the uh, the major abbey of Cluny. <laughs> I guess in George Cluny? No. Um, in Burgundy, France. The abbey's expansive sloping grounds are a nationally protected War of the Roses, Cameron was right, battlefield as one-time site of the advance of the Yorkists during the Battle of Northampton. There you go. Um... So there you are. Um, so we've just scanned uh, the, we've just gotten the scan. Hold on, let me find it. Um, she says, here we go. Uh, we've just got the QR code. There's a QR code. So we've scanned it. And uh, basically, it's up. So uh, the next player, player number two, is Tara Sims, one of our typically Tina uh, titillators, um, guitarists. Um, and uh, her three clues, clue one is school year section, the school year, one school year section. Clue two is uh, to interpret, but that's plural, interpret. Um, has to be a plural word, the plural of interpret. Uh, clue three is to unweave, unweave. There you go. Tar Sims, pass it on to you, girl. You're next. Uh, 